Today we have 8 hours to pay this Overdrive's Vanguard box. It's time to start this challenge. I've been painting for one hour and I'm really happy of where I am right now because I applied all of the base color on all of the miniatures. Right now I'm just going to apply some contrast on the skin tones to make it pop and to figure out if I have to work a bit more on the skin after I've done this step. We'll see how it's looking in a second. Let's go! I want to try something today with the contrast paint. I'm going to use some matte medium from Vallejo and I'm going to mix both of them and add just a bit of water to use the contrast paints as a shade paint from Game Workshop. We'll see how it works on the miniatures. I feel like Vanguard box are way harder than start collecting ones. Maybe it's because we have more miniature. I just realized that right now. Because it's almost been two hours and I just finished the wash on the skin tone. By the way, I applied contrast paint because it was just way faster than shades. And it's drying a bit faster as well. And I'm starting doing some shading on the moon things, but I mean, it's going to be so hard. I'm just going to leave the Knoblars out for this one and try to work as fast as possible on the metallics right now. I just finished painting the metallic spot and it's been so long. I actually thought it would be even longer. For the silver I used Dura Aluminium from Valeo and for the brass I used this one from a game workshop. Now my augers look pretty okay. So I'm planning of two hours for the iron blasters, two hours for all of this because it's just basically going to be a shade and a highlight and some skin work as well 30 minutes for the two beats beast right there and 30 minutes for the bases i think that should do the trick we'll see how it goes right now it's lunch time so i'm just going to pause it Book. and i'm going to eat because i'm hungry just like the augers are <laughs> I'm back from the lunch break, let's go! So the plan is just to shade everything with my Null Oil recipe and if you don't know what I mean, I will link it in the description box down below. You can see that the skin doesn't look so great right now. What I'm going to do is quite easy. I'm going to take my best color and I'm just going to apply it on every muscle. I will just leave the shadow darker. That should do the trick.
I just finished painting the skin, so I'm now going to paint every leather part, and there is a lot of them. Let's go! Okay, I just finished painting the auger glutens and the lead belchers and I'm now going to take care of the bases because I want them to be glued before I work on the iron blaster for a simple reason is the last step is going to add snow to the base and it should take approximately 15 minutes I think so if the base are ready and everything is glued, I will know exactly how long I can work on the iron blaster. Let's do this! The mini looks quite okay. They look good. They look good for such... Um, small painting session for so many huge guy they look pretty good what i'm going to do is i'm going to paint the wood with dark brown and then dry brush some brown on top of it paint the horns and this part as well and i think that should do the trick let's go I just finished the snow bases and it took so much longer than I thought it would. So I actually had a good idea starting earlier this step. I have a few different things to finish, but I'm not going to tell you which one are they, so you can have a really nice reveal. So let me time lapse this step. See you in a second. I've been painting for eight hours. <laughs> this one was really fun to do. Like, I'm so happy with the results and every step that I did, I'm just happy. I don't know. Anyway, this challenge was insanely fun to do. I hope that you like it and it's time for... I can't say grand reveal because Squidmore is already saying it, so... If you have any idea of what I could say before showing my miniature, just write it in the description box down below. I'll be glad to see it. Anyway, let's go. Thank you for watching this video until the end. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like it and to subscribe if you are not already. See you next week. Okay.